Hi guys, welcome to a brand new video. Today we are doing Halo Vlogs 13's Top 10 List Show, Episode 3. Today's episode, my top 10 favorite animals. Alright, so without further ado, let's get started. There's the start. Alright, please enjoy. There's a picture. And there's another one. Alright, here we go. Sorry if I'm shaking. It's hard to hold the camera. Anyway, the animal kingdom. Here are some of the uh, classifications of animals. I only listed three, but there are many more. We have birds, which include eagles, canaries, crows, macaws, etc. We have amphibians, which of course includes frogs, toads, salamanders, etc. And then we have mammals, like bears, us humans, cows, monkeys, etc. And now, oh, I almost forgot, there's a picture of a bird, there are some amphibians, and there are some mammals. There's cats, dogs, dolphins, tigers, lions, monkeys, you know, the whole nine yards. Alright, now, my list. Alright, number ten, the tiger. This animal is commonly found in savannas, grasslands, swamps, etc., their scientific name is Pythera tigris, or tiger. They go up to 30 to 40 miles per hour in short bounds. That's how fast they can go. The reason why I like, or somewhat like this animal, is only because of Tigger from the Winnie and the Pooh series. And that's the truth. I mean, <laughs> Yeah. I just embarrassed myself on camera. Anyway. Number nine, cats. They are common pets, even though the species cat has such animals as tigers, lions, and hyenas. Their scientific name is Felis catus, or either feline cat or just cat. They have many species, like the Siamese, the American long hair, and the Persian cat. I put this on number 9 because I, like, I only like playing with them. Not allergic, but not my fave, which is true. I only speak the truth in this series. Number eight, a crow. This is a species of bird. Their scientific name is Corvus, which means crow. They usually come in black color, but they could come in other colors, but the most common one is black. I like them because I like birds, and I also like the Na Native American history and culture. And there's a Native American cry tribe called the crow. So, here you go. All right, number seven on the list is giraffe. Or as Jeffy from SML calls it, a giraffe, but it's pronounced giraffe, English. Anyway, this animal can be found at savannas and woodlands. They have long necks to reach leaves from tall tree parts to reach the tall leaves. Their scientific name is Giraffa camelopardalis, which means giraffe. I like them a little bit because of the fact that they have long necks and long purple tongues. That's my favorite fact about them, that they have purple tongues. Anyway, my list continued. Number six, the grizzly bear. They are found mostly in wood-like places, ex for example, forests. Their scientific name is Ursus arctos horribilis, which means horrible night bear, if you translate it from Latin to English. They live for about 20 to 25 years in the wild. I like them because I have a big stuffed bear and it's cute. To me, anyways. You've probably seen it in one of my play fight videos or whatever. We named him Grizz. Thought that would be a suitable name. Anyway. Number five. Humans. Okay. I know this may sound weird, but they are humans. Just wait until you hear my reason. They are found all over the world. There are a couple billion of them. Their scientific name is Homo sapien, or Homo sapien sapien, which means smart man. They are. There are billions of us in the world, like I said. And the reason why I like them is because we are a unique species. We are one of the few species that do what we do. For example, war, talk, even go to space. I know that there are some animals that go to space, but we're the first, we're the real first people to go to space. And we're even the first animal to go on the moon, so. Yeah, some people think the moon landing's a hoax, but I don't believe that. Number four, chameleons. They are found anywhere from rainforest to deserts. They live for about five or so years, so not that long. Their scientific name is 
Chameleonide, or chameleons. I'm not good with Latin. I like them because they are able to change colors, and I think that is pretty. I bet some of you guys might think it's pretty as well. Alright, number three, dogs. They're very popular as a domesticate, domesticate, I can't speak English, domesticated pet. Some breeds include the Poodle, the German Shepherd, Chihuahua, Bernese Mountain Dog, and many others. Their scientific name is Canis Lupus Familiaris, which means friendly wolf dog, or friendly wolf. I like them because they are very cute. I would love to have one as a pet, because I don't, and yeah. If you're wondering what kind of breed I would want, I would want either a Bernese Mountain Dog or a German Shepherd or a Collie or something like that. Alright, my list continued. There are only two, I think, left. Yeah. Number two, eagles. They are a species of bird commonly found anywhere in the northern hemisphere. They are the national animal or the national bird of the United States of America. Their scientific name is... Asipiteridae, which means hawk or eagle. I like them because of their status in the animal kingdom. Also, I have a stuffed eagle and it's very cute, so. I gotta have some fun reasons, so there you go. Alright, my number one favorite animal is a lion, and here's why. Well, first, here's some facts. Lions live in biomes such as deserts, grasslands, and savannas. They are considered the king, king, of the savanna or wherever they are found. Their scientific name is Panthera Leo, which means panther lion or just lion. I love them because I feel like the lion is my so-called spirit animal. I feel like my personality is like a lion, which is true. So, I mean, I do kind of have a temper sometimes, and lions can be pretty temper, have a high temper, so that's one thing. Um... You know, there are many attributes, but yeah. I hope you guys, oh, I'm sorry. Thanks for watching this top 10 list. I hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, share, and subscribe for more. Click that bell for notifications of new videos coming your way. Thanks, and I love you all. Halo Vlogs 13, out. And there are my citations. And now for real, I'm out. See you next time.